Hello guys, welcome back to Hearts of Mind 4. Kaiserak playing as the Austrian Empire. Uh, so, yeah, we are in the war with the or in a war with the Belgrade Pact. So that's just nice and oh, oh dandy. Did you just get encircled? Get it encircled, Hungary. Yes. Uh, no, could do this. And over here, uh, sure, try. We have what's spare planes? Alright, naval bombers. Yeah, that's not gonna be a big problem here. Uh, volunteers have returned home. Alright, uh, join here. Too bad you didn't. Yeah. The CNTFIA is winning. <laughs> that's a mouthful. Oh no, you fools! Well, I think we are getting this one at least. Uh, so, uh, really? Uh, okay. They continue to fight. Wait, what? I'm surprise Oh, wait, what? Uh, what about hi Huh? Okay. I guess that's that. Take all states. Uh, can I just liberate you? No. But I don't really... well... I guess I'll liberate them or something. I don't know. Um, right. Go here. You go here. Uh, uh, the annexation of Romania. The Iron Guard regime has been extinguished and their crimes against humanity are finally stopped. We no longer have to worry about them. I liberate them or occupy them. Liberate. Uh, owner, star car, okay. A puppet of Austrian Empire. The new Romanian regime. Yes. The new Romanian regime. Now that Romania is a normally independent nation again, we need to decide on the government's form. Ministers in our cabinet argue for either two options. The first option is to invite the well-known socialite Antonio... Anton Antonin... Antonio... whatever... Bibesco to rule Romania. He's the grandson of the last ruler of Wallachia and as such bear the titles of prince. Since he lacks a real power base, he would be a loyal ally, but still give some legitimacy to the new regime due to his royal heritage. Uh, the other option is to invite former regent of Romania, Prince Nicholas, to form a government. He's the younger brother of the former crown prince Carol, who has refused to rule as a puppet king. Under the former military regime, Nicholas' position as regent was already nothing more than a puppet, so it is expected he won't cause much trouble, while still normally continue the rule of the Hohenzollern dynasty. Republic, a puppet kingdom. What the kingdom? Totality, to totalists in the Baratia commune. As the leader of the Baratia commune, Maxists, no, Maximists, what, faction, and its recently elected head of state, Supas Chandra Bose gave a fiery speech to an electrified crowd in Calcutta today, promising that his new totalist government would do whatever it took, whatever it takes, to deal a death blow to the colonial lapdogs of the Northern Dominion of India and the decadent oppressors of the Western Princely Fe Federation. He claimed that the Bharatiya Commune would stand on its own two feet to accomplish its task and prove to the rest of the world that India is a force to be reckoned with. Interesting. Now, uh, I don't want Serbia, to be honest. Um, mm, 
But we can't... Oh, right, they said they removed this, right? Or something? In this uh, mod or something, we get an event for this, maybe? Maybe? Well, that's good. Oh, here we go. The Nation of Serbia. Yes. Uh, liberate. Now behave, Serbia. I won't tell you again. Occupied puppet. Hmm. You went the dawn. Oh, it's white. <laughs> Bit difficult to see. Uh hmm. But fine. I wonder if they could join our faction. No. We don't get any event for this, Serbia? I guess not. Oh. Our uh, ideology has grown. Excellent. Mm -hmm. uh, don't have a lot of manpower. Auto Ender. Eh. Daily political power gain. Oh. Social Democrats, Social Democrats, Liberals, Social Conservatives. Hmm. At least it doesn't give minus. But uh, makes planning. Resource gain. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. Oh, we were taking this. All right. Skoda. Uh, that was like the Skoda company and bonus to Kampfwagen. Austro Daimler approaching Albania. Right, we already control Romania with this, so that's fine. Uh, we can no longer sit idly by as Albania sits on our south, free of our influence. It's time to settle the question of where they stand. Yes, that's right. Oh, right. We would war with those three. Hmm, interesting. Nationalist victory in South Africa. After a contentious election, which has divided the Union of South Africa in two, the National Party, led by J.B.M. Herzog, has declared victory, though with the slimmest of majorities in the country's parliament. Voting in South Africa is restricted mainly to whites, split between the Afrikaners in the north and the British in the south. Yet with the Afrikaners vehemently supporting Herzog, they were able to achieve victory. Unrest in the British areas is on the rise, however, particularly within the native population who fear the National Party's planned apartheid policies, and many are predicting the country will fall to violence or even civil war before long. Interesting. Interesting. So this is still raging on. We could actually send some over again. Even though it doesn't look too well for... well... Uh, do you have any support? French, German... okay. Well, we could send uh, over two dudes again. Achtung. You and you. Uh, take the mountaineer guy, yeah. Hmm. Uh. Do we want Carlos Spain, right? Or do we want the Kingdom of Spain? Now I'm confused. The Pope said to f support Carlos Spain. But they are Falange Española. They are authoritarian democracy. They are paternal aut autocrats. Why would the Pope support you? Hmm. He 
looks serious. Send uh, you again. Okay. Ah, we need political powerpoints. Could also not do a national idea for some time to get uh, a few more points. Oh, more wars. Ugh. Turn the economy. Oh. Okay, hmm. Kingdom of Spain has fallen. That's very concerning. Okay, I don't think. Uh, I think it's somewhat over. Well, depends if they have 20 and these guys have 24. <laughs> There's not, but looking grimmer and grimmer. Okay, they arrived in Navarra. Gonna help? Eh, well, sure, try. Continue. This is hills. Okay, Ooh, we could maybe do an encirclement here, perhaps. Bit risky. Meh. Uh oh, don't. Uh, well, they're not moving anywhere. Oh. Military factories. How lovely. Uh, let's build one more tank. One more here. Now, manpower wise, you have zero, you have zero. Alright. Both have zero. Okay. Uh, the Principality of Albania was left under Austrian influence after the Weltkrieg, but a delegation was forced to abscond due to internal problems. Now, however, we are ready to resume our earlier contact. Uh, what? Fasimilil? Fasimail? From Vienna? Yes, try. Okay, hmm. try and... We'll get some organization here first. Oh, really? Albania. I really wasted a whole thing on that. Well, let's actually get this. I need some points. The KK Ministeria are similar to the once common Ministeria with Hungary, meant to coordinate administrative sub efforts with the new subjects. Right, get that. Oh, go here. Uh, you stay here. Encircle these two. Oof, yes, uh, go here. Okay, stay there then. Mm. Okay. Wow, winning slash losing, winning. Elastic defense, nice. I guess. Uh, yeah, too bad we don't have any tanks right now. So, mobile infantry or Blitzkrieg? Let's take Blitzkrieg. How many tanks do we have? Uh, light tank. 300, alright. Is that enough for a small company? Mm, go ahead and help. Or not. Mm. The fall of Burgos. 
reports from the burgers confirm the Carlis temporary capital has been captured by advancing Anaco Spanish troops after skirmishing in the hilly countryside. Carlist forces put up stiff resistance, hoping to delay the enemy forces, but were eventually beaten back. Castilians fleeing north to the Basque country tearfully describe seeing their homeland burning and CNTFIA soldiers even committing atrocities on their own people. Rumors state King Javier was escorted out with a flow of refugees by Carlist militia, but his destination remains unknown. Many hope Carlist Spain might continue fighting in the central plateau to defend their homes from the crush of the syndicalist invasion. Can the Carlist hope to come back from this? I don't know. It's looking rather grim, to be honest. Yeah, yeah. I think it's about time to eject these troops here. If possible. Okay, go up here. Too bad this encirclement didn't really work. Okay, we we retook really Burgos, but uh, I wonder how many men we need to be able to send three volunteers. Probably a lot more. Okay, civil wars galore. French Republic, okay. Morocco. Oh, your Reich's Commissariat, okay, or whatever it's called. S oh, South Receipt. Oh, it's a three way war? Ah, okay, both of them are going after this. I think. Or something. The South African Civil War. With the recent victory in the South African 1938 elections, uh, the National Party under President James Herzog was confident it could implement its sweeping changes to the country's system of uh, racial segregation, what they call apartheid. Regardless of protests from the more British-leaning provinces of Natal and the Cape, of, of the Cape, of, <laughs> of Natal and the Cape. Today, that confidence was proven ill-founded as leaders in Durban signed a document they called the. Natal Covenant, which declares that they will never surrender to the nationalists and will see their government toppled by force. Battle lines which already be, have already been drawn, splitting the country in two as the civil war wa has broken out to determine South Africa's path once and for all. Dire situation. Don't have any more men. I'm not sure how can you can keep attacking here. Okay, more industry. We are on 38. Do we have a? Uh, no, we don't have this, which we really should have. Okay, a radio. No, radar. Um. Get this. Here, you should be fighting decent in the terrain. Eh, uh, somewhat. Mm, go here. Okay, stop. Uh, oh. Do we need it? No, not right now. Need the points for, well, a lot of stuff. You have no men left here. Strength 1%. Okay, we need to get this is growing. Yes. Nah. Hills, flatlands. Here, oh, <laughs> more civil wars. Uh, I guess commies, yes, and well, 
all, all the dudes. A lot of commies in this mod. Goddamn commies. Godless commies. Um, right, go over here. Maybe we could cut these guys off, actually. Like, do this. Uh, or not. We are being invaded from all sides here. Okay, go here. No, I'll help. Uh oh, ooh, right, the radar station. Let's get one here. And here and here. Okay, build that first. Well, also build a oh no, military factory and a civilian. We have some spare stuff here. Right, get this. Mm. We lack what? Steel, chromium, oil. Aluminum, ugh. Eh. Put this here. Bit annoyed that infrastructure doesn't increase uh, infrastructure. No, uh, resource gain. But oh well. Okay. Try and kill this bad boy. Oops. Mongolian Carnate, okay. <laughs> Mongolian Horde keeps rising. On who? Oh, these dudes, okay. Huh. <laughs> the Mad Baron, or whatever he was called. Uh, uh, no? Try again. Oh, he's very happy. That's understandable, the way things are going for them. Mm. Oh, no, 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 what am I doing? Okay, some points, lovely. More points, more points. Ooh. And, well, let's check over here as well. Oh, we have so many things we want to do here. Gain base war support. That's over here. Rifle trials. Okay. Radar, rocket. Mm. The Austro Daimler. Okay, approaching Greece. Well, we do need steel, right? Yeah, 12. So, well, let's take this then. Building slots in Kustenland and Salzburg, that's fine. Now here, I want... at war. Oh, god damn it. Need to be at war. Well, then I don't want anything. Industry, oh... Oh, I thought we couldn't have this before we had the... Oh, we can't. Right, it's blacked out, or what it's called. The civilian, military, it's pretty damn good, though. Huh. Skoda was probably here, then? Yeah. Light tank, medium tank. Uh, Soft, hard, soft, hard. Bit more cost. Hmm. Sure, let's get Skoda then. Uh, also, let's check the time first. Alright, still some time to go. We have no... What is this? M. Landsturming Infantry Division. Militia. Landswehr. 
Okay. Hmm. Division designer. Um. No. Yes. Great empty. Mechanized. Mm. Armored. Let's put armored then. Um. Light tank. We don't have any heavy tanks, do we? I don't think so. Mm, how many light tanks is it? 60. I think we have like 300 or something. Um. Okay, that's 300, but that's only 10 here. Uh, do we have any motorized? No, I don't think so, actually. Hmm. It's only 10, that's not enough. Uh, hmm. Organization is very low at the moment. Hmm. I think we need like motorized infantry. Yeah, to get organization up. Yeah, so we need to actually build a lot of that, uh, like this. Let's get... Uh, oh. <laughs> never mind, we don't have the points for it. Never mind, never mind. Okay, this is not going too well. If I have to say so. Myself. Okay, computing machine. I think that's less research time. Yes, let's get decryption. We can see what the hell is going on. Go over here, have a look. Ugh, that's a lot of encirclement. Yeah. Uh, a visit from Liechtenstein. We've just received a state visit from Principality of Liechtenstein. The Principality of Liechtenstein is the final remnant of the Holy Roman Empire and due to its unique geographic location has survived up to now. Since 1818 they've been under our protection, first through our leadership of the German Confederation and later through bilateral treaties. Prince of France has stepped down from the throne and named his 31-year-old first cousin twice removed as regent. To celebrate the occasion, they have brought us gifts and good wishes. In turn, we have, giving the new we have given the new prince gifts and wish he wished him a long and happy reign. How lovely. Oh, well, don't mind if I do. Liechtenstein, they're not on the map, are they? No. I think they're around here or over here. I can't recall. I think it's over here. Also Albania. Hmm. Didn't want to join me, huh? Very disappointed. Uh, can we save these guys? Not sure. Already pushing here as well. And they took or whatever it was there. Counter attack. Brazilian major country. Okay. Uh, they are hmm, yeah, not doing too well. Uh, go here and help. Oh no. Uh, stop. Go over here. Well, no, go here. Help. Push them across the river. Or not. Over here, I think we're about to evac to the curb. No, we're not. Oh well. Hmm. 
Hmm. So the commies won Iberian Federation. Won here as well. Spanish Civil War over. The Spanish Civil War is finally over, and it seems that the Iberian Federation has emerged triumphant. Much of the countryside lies in ruins, and order has not completely been restored. But the anarcho Spanish government announced that the old feudal order has finally been put to rest, and that the people of Spain would now benefit from an orderly transition to a syndicalist regime. Massive crowds gathered in Barcelona to hail the returning militias and to offer a prayer that the new peace will turn into a permanent one. Interesting. We'll see. Still not sure. Okay, Saudi Arabia capitulated. Still not sure how Portugal got Galicia, but uh, hmm. huh? It's Ireland on the Reichsprach. Huh. Okay. Okay. The CAS is researched. Tactical bomber. Sure. The Bulgarian question. Oh, you're turning communist as well. God damn it. Everyone is turning co turning communist. Mm. Poland still not in anything. Matthias returned home. You just Join here, that's fine. Right. Up here. Mm -hmm. Also, I found out that uh, a way to integrate uh, like puppets is to... Uh, how is it we did this again? Uh, here. Is to... Uh, apparently, I looked up in the wiki, is to build stuff in their country. And the way they become became more free is to if they did something. Uh, like contributed to war as in here um, so we actually want to build stuff in their land yeah we do want to well annex this form the Austria well Austrian Empire across the map here South Rhodesia has capitulated on certain times all right down to here That's Herzog, right? So Jan Christian Smuts. Hmm. Uh, I think the commies are losing down here. As far as I can tell, they haven't received any received any, yeah, divisions though. This war still going on. Not much have happened. Well, I guess Pacific USA have taken the Baya Peninsula here. Hmm. Yeah. Not good. Organization very low. One more pop and recover rate larger or bigger. Okay. Hmm. Uh, Cancel the lease. Hmm. Do this. The Alps have always been rich, has been a rich mineral resource, but until now we had no idea true extent. We had no idea of the true extent of well of the wealth we've been sitting on. Huge amounts of iron ore are being taken from our previous mines, and new mines are springing up daily. Subsidi subsidizing or partially na na nationalizing these industries would greatly increase our economic independence. Yes, get that going. Um, right here. I would like to, well... Oh, I can't do this. Oh, really? Do this. Hopefully that will make them like us. Why can't we... Autonomous puppet. Is it improve relations? Mm. No, it's like here. No. 
Okay. Hungary. Uh, active attaches, land leasing. This war still. What's this? My Shrieky Kingdoms, okay. Okay, good stuff. Get this one. I'm rolling. Oh, we didn't go to war. I like all these stories they put into the uh, the characters. What are you, Mongolian puppet? Okay. <laughs> Is that a faction? Yeah, great carnate. Untant. Hmm. Oh, you're still in the Belgrade Pact. Okay. Why was it you? Uh, yeah. What happened here with Greece? They suddenly stopped, like being in the war up here. Very odd. Take the time. Okay. About to cut. I guess we'll... Yeah, let's wait for this, then cut. How are we doing, Germany? Still... Victors of the Weltkrieg? Oh. I guess because I took over Romania or something. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, I ran. War with Egypt, okay. Oh, Germany controls the Suez, right. Uh, okay. Hmm. War with both Iran and Ottoman Empire and Yemen. surprising. I wonder if there's a... Uh, yeah, what do you call them? Event for that or something? Hmm. Anyways, we are just in 39, so I guess we should take this here. And go over here and get... Uh, well... Brr, 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 get this. Very interesting. Poland still very mad. Okay, hmm. mm -hmm. almost done with that. Going incarnate, grew ever bigger. Or did they pop at them? No. Or they took this right. Something. Anyways, uh, let's. Um, Astral Daimler. Mm, 47. Jesus Christ, that's a long time. Let's do the approaching Greece. 
There yet remains a lingering question over Greece's position. We should seek to drag her kicking and screaming into our sphere of influence. Yes, try that. Anyways, I need to cut here. So, thank you for watching. Please leave a like, comment, or subscribe if you enjoyed this content. Very much appreciate your support, and I hope I'll see you next time. Bye.